Yo, welcome back to the Double and Be Mob channel, man. Today we are here with Stevie Ray Vaughn, Texas Flood, live at the El Macombo. Never heard of that. Um, never heard of Stevie uh, Ray Vaughn. Um, yeah, I know I got to do a little bit of research. This was recommended after um, I want to say one of the Zeppelin videos, or it may have, it may have been. Um, I forgot, was it Elvis? Somebody I reacted to and somebody said, you gotta react to Stevie uh, Ray Vaughan. Now, never heard of him. Um, so I'm, I'm curious to see who we dealing with here. Uh, an American musician best known as the guitarist and front man of the blues rock trio Stevie Ray Vaughan and Double Trouble. Never heard of Double Trouble. Although his mainstream uh, career only spans seven years, he is regarded as one of the most influential musicians in the history of blues music and one of the greatest guitarists of all time. Okay. We're dealing with the blues here. All right. Y'all know, know I'm a sucker for the blues, man. Y'all know this. The blues is you want to if if you want to know how to get my attention, just have an electric guitar and just just give me the blues. Sing about the blues. It's such a cheat code. It, it like it's I don't know of anybody who doesn't love that jazz blues just raw type of music. Like, I don't know anybody who doesn't like that style of music. It's almost impossible not to like it. it it's, it's, it's amazing. So, Texas Flood, um, there could be so many different things. So, I'm, I'm not even sure how to predict this song. And he's regarded as one of the greatest guitarists of all time. I mean... Again, I'm at a point now where I, I just don't understand how I've never heard of, like, certain people. But it's like, I just, I, I, I don't, I don't know. It's, it's at a point now where I'm actually getting frustrated. Because I'm like, I missed out on so much good music. And granted, so much of this music came out way before I was born. Some even before my mother was born. But, I mean, damn, I just missed everything. But we here now. That's the beauty of this. We here now. So, Stevie Ray Vaughan, Texas Flood. This is a live performance. I'm excited. I'm ready to go. So, let's go. stopped on the guitar solo we uh, kill me just go ahead and kill me put it in the comment section I know I'm sorry but something that I love about great guitars it's all feel like good amount of them they don't look at their guitar like you got to like I've seen a good amount of guitars they literally like stare at their fingers and and you know that's understandable but like I notice a lot of the greats it's almost as if whatever whatever they about to play, it, it just it, it's right here first, and it's like they don't have no control. It's like they not even doing 
it's like they're not in control. It's like they're in a trance. Like, he just looked like he just, eh, like, when you see Jimmy Page, he just doing his thing. Um, I seen Hendrix a couple of times, uh, <laughs> of course, live on YouTube. But, like, they don't even, like, look at what they doing. They don't even look at the crowd. It's like they doing whatever the music tell them to do. And it's like it's not controlled. It's it's crazy. Okay, the last 30 seconds, I'm not going to lie, we got to hear that again. He's going nuts. For one, his style. Like, I don't know if that's a flannel or what type of shirt. I don't know what this chain is on his neck. I notice he got like, it almost looked like his guitar is a little worn down and it got stickers on it. Like, his whole style. I mean, and then you finish it off with the hat. And then this voice that just came in. I mean, hey, yo, I, 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 look. Now, y'all know I'm not above running out this room. Y'all know that. So, we going. <laughs> All right, Stevie. All right, now. It's my first video. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so, I'm sorry, man. Listen, man. Hey. Where is he? He's from Texas? Where is the dude from? Do y'all hear his voice? He almost sound like... almost sound like a mix of, like, Louis Armstrong and, like... Like, B.B. King or something. Like... Who is this dude? Well, He's striking this guitar.
Mm. Mm. Not for nothing, he almost like remind me of Hendrix. Am I tripping? Am I st- listen? I'm new. I'm new. Don't judge me. Y'all know I'm slow. He remind me of Hendrix. But he white. Who is this dude? And he is sweating like... He, like, he is in this performance. I was about to say, I thought it looked, almost looked like a piece of his guitar was broke or something. No way. Is he about to play this shit back? Come on, look at the spin. Check this out. That man, that man reminded me of Zeppelin so much. Like I said, I'm not that in tune with 
I, I said Zeppelin. Um, Hendrix. He reminds me of Hendrix so much. Like, for one, his style. That hat was fire. That whole fit was fire. I gotta, I gotta find out who this is. Stevie Ray, uh, Ray Vaughan. He was born in Dallas. Began playing guitar at the age of seven. Inspired by his older brother, Jimmy Vaughn. In 72, he dropped out of high school and moved to Austin. Where he began to gain a following after playing gigs on the local club circuit. Um, he was signed to Epic Records. Within months, he achieved mainstream success for a uh, critically acclaimed debut album, Texas Flood. So it's an album. And I would assume he had a single or a song was called Texas Flood on the... Um... Okay, yes, Texas Flood. It's a blues song recorded by Larry Davis. That sounds very familiar. Larry Davis. He's a Texas blues and souls uh, musician. I, I, I definitely heard of Larry Davis before. Um, uh, it's... Okay, hold on. I, I I'm just trying to I'm just trying to get I'm trying to figure out what I'm dealing with here cuz I I'm not going to lie to you. He reminded me of BB King and Hendrix. I don't know why I said Louis Armstrong. His voice it, it, I, I wish he sung a little bit more. His voice I, I'm not going to lie. It's probably the it's probably the cleanest Blues, like a lot of guys that sing the blues, it's so much grit and so raw that it's you know like his was smooth. It like it's it like what people like to cook, like a whiskey. What's a smooth whiskey that people like that you can drink? Like something that you like. You got a lot of whiskey. It's like the second it touch your tongue, you just ugh. But you got some whiskey, it's like, ah, okay, I could take that. That's what his, like, his voice is smooth. But it's, it's raw and it's the blues. But I, I, I've, I've, I've never, I've never heard of this guy. And I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. He's number 66 in Rolling Stone Magazine's 100 Greatest Guitar, oh, the song. 100 Greatest uh, Guitar Songs of All Time. This is number 66. This dude right here, I need more. That's all I'm going to say. I need more. I need to find out more about Stevie Ray Vaughan immediately. Recommend it. I need to hear it. This is that blues that I ain't going to lie to y'all. Like I I I've never been to a jazz or blues club. I've always wanted to. Um Yeah, this is um this is right up my alley. This is perfection. I want more. Stevie Ray Vaughn. For one, I love his name. His name is fire. Stevie Ray Vaughn. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. But I think Stevie Ray Vaughan. Um, please recommend more. That, 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 I, I'm going to just leave it there. Recommend more. I got to hear more of this guy. This brother's special. I'm talking, I'm talking about him like he's some new act. This brother's special. Like, this is different. I got to hear more. Please. As always, like, comment, subscribe. Recommend more of Stevie Ray Vaughan. I need to hear more immediately.
please and thank you. Until next time, peace.